Welcome to This Week in Astronomy, brought to you by Celestron, the world's leading manufacturer of telescopes. I'm Dave Eicher, editor of Astronomy Magazine, and what do we have coming up this year now? A special event. It's a leap year. February 29th, we get an extra day. Well, why is that exactly? The whole problem dates back to trying to refine calendars and adjust them to what the universe is doing. We have a 365-day year on our calendar, but the orbits of the sun, the moon, the planets, and so on really are attuned to almost a 365 and a quarter day year. Once every four years, we add another day in, a leap day, but that's not super precise. So every 100 years, we have to leave that out, and every 400 years, stick it back in. So it's a tricky business. Uh, the sun and the moon and the planets will do what they want to do. Human bookkeeping, you can't blame this on Johannes Kepler. It's relatively precise, but it's really not absolutely precise. So we have these little adjustments in our calendar and in our daily lives to make out the timing of the orbits just right for our days. So enjoy this extra day, Thursday, February 29th, which I hope you put to good use, maybe taking your Celestron scope out and observing some galaxies or planets. I'll see you next time.